this Every episode time. just started because I went, oh, I forgot the timer, and Tony's like, oh, forgot the timer, well, did you? You know why? You there are, like, there's context. Week, we're gonna be, I'm going to be like, there's oh, I forgot context. the timer, shoe. And then Tony's like, whoa, forgot to tie your shoe, huh? You must be dumb. No, like, no, no. Thanks, Tony. No, the context, the context <laughs> is every time I try to start the episode, you're like, oh, I didn't start the timer. Is and I'm not like, every damn. single time. In fact, this is the this first today, time. Today, today, every first time. time no, today no, that I forgot no, to okay, no, okay, no. Hey guys, welcome back to GDPG. <laughs> In your defense, Cooch, Tony does tend to blow things out of proportion when it comes to making fun of you. Ah, stop it! Oh my god, that's about. too bad. That's too. He is tickling me. I don't like it. That's two. So give me two, damn it! <laughs> Until like you say two, he did it twice. I will not drop this. He did it twice. So okay, okay. Let's 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 let's. Uh, yeah, let's focus on the game. Not, not to give me two. Let's. God, uh, damn it. Ooh. Hey, should we save? Oh, fucking. Fuck. I think we already did. I think you did. Yeah, who cares? But uh, <laughs> so <laughs> all this data. <laughs> who cares? Just delete it all. So I think what we're doing now is we just need to go around and destroy all those like strange shadow wolf heads I have a question with about fire. that I have an actual question because sure. I don't remember them being there when I was playing with you guys well we first were introduced to it at the end of the last episode that Jen was in okay mm-hmm. so if we don't destroy them does the game just not continue or is there I some kind of if I recall correctly it's a necessary component to advance okay. the story okay I could but be wrong. nothing comes out of them. It's just you. It's just a time waster. Right. Yeah. That's sort of the unsatisfying thing about it. I when I first saw them, I was like, "Oh, I'm gonna have to battle something yeah, right? whenever I see like bump into them." Or if you like burn enough of them, then a bigger one appears that will have like a boss or. Right. Exactly. And it's just there is none of that. It's just you gotta find them and burn them. That's super weird. I don't it's, like that. From a exploration design standpoint, I can see why they thought it might be kind of fun. Oh, come on, uh, Edna. Eleven gold? What are you doing? I know, right? That's, see, that's what I'm used to seeing is just, like, that tiny menial amount, but... Oh, how dare she only give us eleven gold? One gold can feed a family. That's, that's not true. Yeah, no, not really. Not In fact, most meals are about a hundred gold for the yeah, cheapest ones. so, like, we can afford, like, a hundredth of a no, meal. No, I... That... Conver- sorry, real quick. The one gold can feed a family thing reminded me of, uh... I actually picked that up from a conversation I had with, uh, Nick... We were playing, uh, we were getting ready to play Harry D&D. Poppins, for those who don't yeah, know. Harry Poppins. Uh, I don't like calling him that. Uh, <laughs> it's such a ridiculous I name. It's so great. Uh, Makes me smile. We're getting ready to play D&D, and we're, like, starting at a higher level, so we have access to all this money. And there was, like, thousands upon thousands of gold that we had. And I was like, Nick, can you put a gold in perspective for me? He's like, well, I'm pretty sure a gold can feed a farming family for about a month. I was like, oh, good. Good, and we're just rolling around in it. That's that's good. That's great. Seems like a kind thing to so do. So wait, yeah, is, is oh this yeah. the D&D campaign you're running? No, no. Oh, this okay. is forever ago. This oh. Is back at oh. college days, I think. <laughs> oh. Although that's a pretty good way of uh, like setting the scale of, yeah. of the money. It you also kind of like makes you feel a little bit like a dick, too. Like, oh, you guys are hungry and thirsty? Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Look at this sword, right? <laughs> this is like a thousand gold. <laughs> But it also like makes you really feel wealthy easy. as hell. Yeah, that's true. Now, here's my question. What if, like, the dealers mark up prices because they know we're, like, a traveling crew? It's oh, like... They totally do. It's like a tourist shop. Yeah, like, right? Oh. I bet you all the other families pay, like, one gold for every, like, a hundred we pay. Should settle at least a little bit now. Yeah. Okay, so the the little shadow hounds were the source of the epidemic. Yeah, and malevolence. Feels like the malevolence has been lifted Two. somewhat. Don't you think? <laughs> oh, I think at some point we're going to do a master cut of every time they say malevolence, and I'm going to spend a long time getting all that footage. So please, everyone just watch it. Just. But if we if we finish this series to completion, which I really still want to do. It'd be nice. It'd be a really silly thing. Dude, it'd be like a four-hour video. I know, right? You'd be sitting there like, I can't oh, fucking editing do this it, again. editing that's gonna be a nightmare, but I want to do it anyway, just because it's so. You better start now. I actually, that's not a bad idea. Probably should have started yeah. yesterday, or maybe when we first Edit, started well, recording. Yeah, like editing everything forward, just like mark every time a level. Yeah, right. Like, a big red mark. It means Why? I have to actually pay attention to the footage a lot more while I'm editing it. 
I wonder where Edna went off to. To be fair, I usually play off of audio cues from us. Mm. Like, oh, someone said this and this. Let me add like a stupid animation in. What did you see that? She got. Uh, he hit him. He. She hit him on the head with an umbrella. Yeah, her her main attack umbrella. Hey, Kujo, it's your best friend. Attack. It's attack. I'm here to help. Or tell you folks. He's here to help. Attack things. We I'll lick your hand. Hey, at least there's context for him being attack because he's going to give us a stronger attack against the Drake. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like his voice. He talks like this. He's that great. I'm so happy you're around. Hey, if you were that little, you would have a tiny little voice box too. I'm actually hoping he's like that. I'm hoping he's like, hey, baby, what's up? Super pubes. <laughs> It'd be like I'm the, attack. You'd be like the turtles. <laughs> All right. Hey. I just turned into Dr. Mrs. the Monarch. <laughs> we may be the size of children, but we talk like we're in the Mafia and we've been smoking cigarettes since I, we were ten. I really appreciate the gimmick that doesn't center around the sound of my voice. <laughs> Working on the smoker voice. Yeah. You, can be, you too can be a turtle someday, Tony. Chris is Smoke cigarettes! So Chris is gonna be editing this later and come across that, that audio bit yeah. and be like, God oh, damn it. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's some like ASMR shit. Oh, baby. Right there. Oh, yeah. Is this GDPG? Sweet talking is, to is this yeah. gonna turn into GDPG ASMR? Yeah. This is late night GDPG. I am your cool master. Dude, it'd be awesome to have Papa a Papa Geek station. Areas. Station. Mm. Station. You can, call, you can call me Papa G. Because I pop them G. Whoa. Oh, shit. Stop yelling into the microphone. You just clipped it. <laughs> <laughs> well, your in between takes was, you're not close enough to the mic. People can't hear you. Okay. That's true. The rest of this episode, I'm right here. Don't worry, guys. We got this. You're going to sound like shit. <laughs> Yeah, you think you sound all smooth and nice, but the audio is gonna be like, <laughs> well, it's, it's like that one video I did um, that I added on the end of one of our episodes that was like, hey, by the way, this is a thing we're doing. We're starting this question of the day, Jazz. Oh, yeah. And I was definitely too close to the microphone. And is this Power Rangers? Dude, I, I told you. He's, he's powering up our attack. Boom, look at that uh, shit. Mega Arrow. <laughs> look at me, he's like, God, Key Rhymes. I'm gonna start saying that now. <laughs> Key rhymes. I don't think I can say that any better than you, though, Tony. <laughs> I got problems. I still think my favorite thing you ever say, Chris, is God fucking shit. <laughs> I never said that. I don't know if I've said that on the show, though. Well, but you were like, wow, wow. Yeah. And I was like, well, technically, wait, it's a complete we're not going to take out the Drake with one arrow, are we? Well, you'll see. You'll we're going to fight him, right? That's not an arrow. That's a fucking harpoon. That's a, no, that's a fucking ballista. Dude. Yeah, there you go. Yay. He's like, I'm special. Yeah, Power Rangers pose. Where's the explosion going off behind him? No, but they didn't attack grass yet. Now, well, he's now, just, uh, now he's gonna help us turn into the Megazord. <gasps> Dude, don't don't Do not fuck with me. And now I'm not. Oh shit! I'm over here, guys. No, we're good. No. Weird. Oh right, I should not do the bubbles. Should I not attack because? <laughs> Well, well, someone's okay, almost dead. You're um, um, I will heal you. Heal! There you go. I healed you. You're welcome. No, it's not me. It's not me. Oh, I healed you, Lila. Congratulations. You're, you're healed. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh, oh did they oh, just break you up? Just like that? I, oh. I can, I can, can someone the heal? Can someone heal me? I'm at 779. Hold on, I need to beef up my SC. 779! I'm at 438 now. Kuja, you wanna hurry up on that? I mean, it works for communication, I guess. Where's my target? Oh, bitch. Uh, 867539! Press the bumper? You might have to do that as you're casting. I I am, though. Oh, okay. Oh, there you go. I think you use the D pad. Use the D pad. It doesn't do it. Oh, really? See, I can do that with when I'm armatized and I'm casting like restoration. <laughs> if I hold the button, then I can then I can change. I'm blocking so with think. Alicia right now, and it's really funny to move oh, around shit. when you're in block. Oh god, I need healing. I'll give you barrier instead. Barrier. <laughs> I think barrier also healed me, actually, a little bit. Dude, this dragon is not easy. Right? You'd think for. Uh... Uh... Oh, that was me. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You'd think for someone that we just shot down with a ballista, he'd be a little bit uh. 
a little wounded. Oh, can somebody heal me? Oh boy. Lila, do your fucking job. <laughs> you know what would have been a great opportunity for polish in this little sequence? Was when we were shooting that ballista arrow. If uh, the player actually was the one that got to aim and shoot it. Oh, that would have been so Wouldn't terrible because cool? I've missed. It will, okay. It now, fun, real though. quick, real quick. I have encountered something like that in a different game. Dynasty Warriors came out with a game called Warriors ROT3. Is their excuse to have a big super game with all their characters matched in? It's awesome. Okay, right. can I not now, hit with Demon Fang? Uh, in the air? Yeah, maybe. Now. Midway Sorry. through Warriors R T three, the idea is that you're trying to take down this gigantic demon thing, and you you think, oh, ballista will work, right? No. So you're coming up with this this gun, this big old mounted gun, mm -hmm. in order to kill. Oh, what was supposed to be, what honestly should have probably just stayed a cutscene of you taking them out with this big old gun, turned into a off the shoulder, annoying as hell shooter that took forever. It was unneeded. It did not make sense with the Oh man, can someone heal me. In oh scenario, sweet. I do not think that having that sort of scenario oh, like on. turn it into a shooter would work. I, I feel like it would take away too much from the rest of the, the mechanics of the game. I, I suppose that's fair. I always appreciated little sequences like that though, just because they yeah. were like fun and interesting and they kinda switch up the game and uh it's like a, having a tiny little mini game, right? Like Yeah. Um I know this is a very, very different kind of game, but that happened a lot in games like Dead Space, where, um, you know, you'd get onto, like, oh, a, I'm dead. a turret or something, and um, suddenly you have to shoot down asteroids, and it's like, whoa, I did not expect this, yeah. but it's kind of cool. It's a nice way of switching up the game. I've consistently died the last two boss fights. Well, you did also just learn how to defend, so I'm yeah. not entirely surprised. <laughs> but, like, Lila wasn't healing me. Lila was like... Fuck you. It's okay. We she killed me a couple of times. We apparently didn't need you anyway, so... That's a lot I, of golf. Sure. I helped knock out a lot of that dude's health. I will maybe give you that? I, I wasn't paying attention to you, to be honest. Well, you wouldn't be. You gotta pay attention, pay attention to you. Got that fucking right, dude. Check out these glass. <laughs> Check out these shades. You think anyone else would wear these? Check out this onset ski robe. <laughs> I like his, his, like, pouch. He's like... Hmm. Or should I say, I was. Poor Damn straight. So many seraphim turned no into giant hellions. Really, there should be a PSA for becoming a hellion. Don't say that. Like, ladies and gentlemen, remember, don't do things selfishly or greedy because dark demons will enter inside your body and transform you into a monstrous beast that ruined the world. Well, consider, we still... The more you know. <laughs> we still... <laughs> we still don't actually know what causes creatures to turn into Hellions. Like, it's malevolence, right? Malevolence. <laughs> but, like, why would that actually do anything? Yeah, you know, why would it? Why? There, I think we will get that explanation. Mm, that's a good question. I, I talked to Covert a lot, and he, he loves watching these videos and, and kind of like dropping his, his comments hints. to me privately. Yes, he should comment on the videos. Covert, then everyone else can talk comment about on it. the video. Um, but he was telling me that we, we learned kind of a lot more about okay. like why humans can't interact with Seraphim. And like there actually are deeper reasons for it that they actually oh. do explain at some point. We just have to get to that, that part of the game, you know? But we'll see. Yeah, I'm very curious. I am too. It'd be nice to know what it is. Because you have those like religious fanatics who are like, oh, he You're prayed about himself. Spell. He's going to be filled with malevolence and greed right, and right. awfulness. And I feel like that is expected in a world where things like malevolence can turn you into a horrifying monster. Like a dragon. Right. Although, the uh, crazy thing too is that the humans can't actually see the Hellions. Oh, true. But they still understand that it can what turn you. What do they in. see? They don't see the dragon, then, huh? It appears the corruption. No, I think they they just see nothing. Like it, it there's no nothing there. So is it like friggin' like paranormal activity or something? Like it's busted down. They're like, oh my god, it's maybe maybe for the seraphim based Hellions, but I think for the humans they still see humans. We kind of saw that in the first town oh, where we saw yeah. the little like goblin -y the dudes goblin -y behind. Dudes. What's this? Um, I don't know though if that's but like. But in this case, with the dragon though, I mean, they they, they don't just see a guy. Fly. Flying around, that'd be fucking weird. Well, he's a seraphim, so they wouldn't see him. Oh, anyway. he's a seraphim. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ooh, okay. Humans can't turn into drakes or dragons. Only seraphim, Only seraphim can. can. Yeah. 
I wonder if one of our party will ever go evil. Oh shit, dude, that'd be kind of cool. One? How crazy would that be? Like, what if, like, Mikleo goes evil for a bit, becomes, like, a big old fucking water dragon? Oh my god! Dude, if... That'd be crazy. It'd be like if Lila betrays us, pisses us all off, is just like, I can't handle this, and just, like, goes apeshit. We're left with just, like, Saray and Alicia and, like, maybe one other person. And Edna's like, well, fuck it, I mean... I guess I'll help. That would be awesome, though. Right? How good would that be if he became, like, a dragon for a bit? That would be like, such a... Cri- save him, too. Yeah, yeah, no, that'd be such a crippling moment for, like, the player party. Oh, yeah, and then, because and Mikhail's, then, like, your best friend. Right, like, exactly. Ooh. And then being able to recover from that is, like, that just would be, I don't know, like, satisfying. Let's see how right and, we become. And, like, plot development. How really, great. That, that would be really awesome. Again, like we've been talking about for a while, we've said this a lot of times, this game was packaged with Tales of Symphonia. Yes. So the big twist in Symphonia had to do with a friend party, or a party, your party member, so maybe this one will too. Yeah. Um... Hmm. What is our question of the day? Do you think having teeny little mini games, like the hmm. idea of having that uh, yeah. the shooting of the dragon, do you think that's necessary for an RPG like this, or is it distracting from the main mechanics of the game? I wouldn't say necessary. Do you think it adds more value, yeah. or do you think it, it takes more, away? Because necessary makes it sound like because it, it wouldn't be necessary. It would just be fun. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Basically, yeah. There you go. Cool. Question will be down in the comment section. Go so ahead, like. Answer. And uh, like, subscribe. Comment, and subscribe. <laughs> you don't have to say that every time. That's it's. We, I mean, I'm we put that on screen anyway, so. Anywho, like, comment, <laughs> subscribe. Thank you for watching, and, uh, everybody. Here's a video. Here's another video. Bye. I got this free rest. I'm not Cujo. Oh, subscribe down here, right? Subscribe. Nope. Subscribe simply. I mean, yeah, you did do that right. Yeah. <laughs> like fucking. <Cujo. laughs> I love you too. Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>